My name is Jim Winkler and welcome to tonight's unfranchised business presentation. I appreciate you taking some time to be with us this evening and I appreciate uh, all the guests who are here to learn a little bit about our business uh, this evening. I'm going to try to take you through this in the easiest manner that I can. Um, I would, I got a couple of recommendations for you right off the bat. If this is your first time seeing it, I would recommend that you see it a, a second or a a uh, third time as well. I think it makes more sense every time you do see it. Give you a quick background. I have been with the company for 24 years as an unfranchised owner. Uh, I have been their vice president of sales for the last 10 years. And uh, as I share what I'm going to share with you, I naturally get pretty excited about it. I love what I talk about. And I tell that to people right up front because I want you to, to understand that uh, it's okay to love what you do and love what you get to talk about and share with people. And uh, I don't ever want to sound like I'm trying to uh, sell you anything or hype you in anything, because really, here's what I want you to do. I want you to evaluate what we have. I want you to look further into it. Uh, if you're like me, the more I look, uh, the more this made sense to me from a common sense standpoint, from a business sense standpoint. I had been a customer for seven months of our isotonic products, which I'll talk about in a little bit before I ever took a look at this as a business. So I've been buying the products once a month or once every other month for seven months. A uh, friend asked me to look at what I'm about to share with you when he asked me to look at it. Uh, I thought I was doing him a favor looking at it. I was busy. I was a vice president of a corporation. I had a young family. I had a lot going on. Um, I canceled two appointments, not because I wasn't interested, but because I was busy. When, when I finally did take a look at this, um, I still didn't understand it the first time. I always tell people, that's why I say, see it a second or a third. I, what I got was I could get my products at cost, which I wanted to do. Uh, and I understood that there was something going on. Second time I saw it, uh, I got the, I still could get those products at cost. I could make some money and maybe make some really good additional money. And the third time I, I saw it, I thought, hey, I think I could turn this into something big. I've always wanted to own my own business. This is a way to do it without some huge investment of money. It was more of an investment of my, my time and effort. Uh, and I could do it on the side of what I was doing. And from there, built that business uh, to a point where after six months, I could walk away from my uh, current job that I had now. I hadn't matched my income and I don't recommend anyone ever doing that, but I could see where this was going and what it was doing and then built it, of course, to a, a full-time uh, income from there. What I, I'm going to do now is I'm going to share with you my slides. And when I share with you my slides, if I see where I've got a share button on here, why aren't I seeing a share button on my, there we go. Don't have to be brilliant to do this. That's something I will guarantee I will prove this evening. Um, there we go. Uh, hopefully everybody sees what I'm seeing right now. And uh, there you're seeing a picture that's my, my wife along with me. She was an unfranchised owner as well. She actually had been one of my customers. So not, not only through this business did I uh, find an, an incredible business that I've had uh, for almost a quarter of a century, but I found, uh, you know, uh, the love of my life, my wife right there that I have. So I guess uh, there's a lot of reasons I get excited about what I'm going to share with you uh, as I go through this. Our current level is what you call an executive field vice president with the company. And, and as I mentioned before, I'm the vice president of sales. And really, that's all you, you probably want to know about me. Let's look at why this might make sense for you, okay? Because that's all I was interested in. I wanted to know a couple things when I looked at this. One, why what, did it make sense? And two, had anyone else done it before me so that I knew I had a plan to follow? I'm going to have a little aloe and water here. <clears throat> aloe juice is one of our products. Very good for your throat, by the way. And let's jump in. MarketAmericaShop.com provides a system for entrepreneurs to create a supplemental income while providing consumers worldwide with a better way to shop. So what, what does that mean? It means one, we purchased a company called shop.com. It's probably going on almost 11 years now for their technology. We purchased it for their talent. We purchased it for the name. Can you have a better name than shop.com when you're talking about an online uh, business? What we're doing is allowing people to build and create what we call their own economy by purchasing from their own business, by being able to build that own business. And we're powered by people just like you and I. 
And, you know, 2020 was an absolutely crazy year, wasn't it? But well before 2020, there were major trends that were already going on that we were already in front of. That just sort of accentuated everything and made everything happen that much faster. Remember, we're a 28-year-old company that's grown quarter after quarter, year after year. And we've done that by what are those trends that are occurring? Well, here are four major trends that have been occurring and are only occurring faster now. One is Unfortunately, a retail store collapse. I say unfortunately because I know there's a lot of good people who have worked in retail or who have had a retail store and that's re really become something that, you know, has fallen away. And again, well before 2020, it was changing. But the positive is there's been a huge rise in online sales, which we've been a big part of. As I mentioned, with that purchase of shop.com, we have over, uh, we have thousands of stores on there and millions of products. And then one to one marketing, uh, replacing mass marketing. And I want you to think about that. When, when I go to buy something, I go on and I look at reviews or I talk to somebody. If somebody gives me a recommendation, um, the odds of me doing it are much higher than if I see an advertisement on TV that doesn't really do a lot for me. Um, TV, radio, things like that, they're, they're things of the past, even ads on Facebook, things like that. You know, they're great, but what really works? What really works is one-to-one -one marketing with people. And then the fourth major trend has been a big, huge rise in entrepreneurship. People realizing I got to take care of myself. I want to be an entrepreneur. That was me. I always wanted to be one. I just didn't know how to do it. And, and this company gave me the ability to do that. We position our position to take advantage of all four of those trends with our unfranchised business. And that business is like a franchise in that it, there's systems, there's proven, proven management systems, there's proven uh, professional marketing tools, standardized training systems, there's market-driven products and services. And I, I have to tell you, if you don't have great products and services, there's no use having a business. So I'm very proud of the products we'll talk about and the products you'll learn about as you evaluate this business. But they're, they're better than just market-driven, they're consumer Consumable and unique, which means people will order and then need to reorder, and unique meaning they'll come back to you to get them. We have great branding and increased visibility at all times, but unlike a franchise, so, so take the best of being a franchise, and those are the things I just talked about. Now, let's get rid of what maybe we don't like about a franchise. The franchise fees or royalties. I looked at buying a franchise a lot of times. It's over $150,000. It can go into the millions if you want one of the big boys. Uh, and then you pay royalties ongoing, which are ongoing percentages of your profit back to a franchise. We don't have that. Here, it's minimal startup expenses. Most people start the business for less than the cost of a cell phone. And, you know, it's always funny. I always tell people if, if your tire went flat or if your cell phone was lost, uh, most people find a way to take care of that within one day. And that's how I looked at it from a business. If I really want to own a business, I'll figure out how to do it. There's great tax advantages owning a business. Um, no large monthly overhead. Uh, we work from our home. We don't carry lots of inventory because the company takes care of all that. There's no territorial restrictions. We can build wherever the company is doing business. Um, and, and then part time. One of the things that really attracted me to this is I could keep that income coming in from my full time job while I was building this on the side. And I don't care if you're looking for extra income. You know, a lot of times I'm, I'm a big believer of multiple streams of income give you security and they give you multiple ways to, to earn and make more money. So I'm a big believer in multiple streams of income. And there's little risk because, again, you're not putting out huge outlays of cash and you're not giving up what you're currently doing. You're fitting this around it. And that's how really everyone who's ever built the business did it. They started that way and they built all the, around it while they were building. The company itself was founded in 1992 in Market America Worldwide is a global product brokerage and internet marketing company that specializes in one-to-one -one marketing. Um, that's a mouthful, right? And I'll explain each of those terms as we go through. We're headquartered in Greensboro, North Carolina. We employ over 850 people globally. We have operations in eight different countries, as you're seeing in front of you. We have an A-plus ranking with the Better Business Bureau. And we've won something called the Torch Award two times from the, the Better Business Bureau uh, of Central North Carolina, where we're located. And the Torch Award is for doing business with trust, performance, and integrity. It says a, a, a tremendous amount uh, about our, our company. Now, I mentioned earlier the growth of the company. And 
What I want you to take a look at now as you're looking at, at your screen, you're seeing on the right hand side a chart that shows the, the growth um, of our um, retail profits and commissions earned during these last um, what would that be last almost 20 years? How many of you wish your, your income had grown that way? Um, you know, we've had estimated accumulated retail sales of over 9 billion. We're really close to $10 billion. And that's with a B. That's a big number. Um, what I like better than, than that accumulated retail sales is the amount paid back to unfranchised owners. Uh, we have had over 2.5 billion paid back in retail profits, and we've had commissions of over 2.5 billion paid back as well for a total of unfranchised owners of over 5 billion of that 9.8 that's been paid back to our unfranchised owners. We have thousands of unfranchised owners who are earning on a weekly basis, and we have hundreds of unfranchised own owners who have earned in excess of a million dollars in commissions with, with the company. You know, as great as things have been going for us, and, you know, even during a very tough year, our company had a, a tremendous year last year, tough year for most people in the world. We had a tremendous year. But, but it's been well before last year, and I know I keep predating that because I think it's important. Well before last year, th th there's been a challenge in the world, and that challenge has been people work 45 years, whether they start at 21 and work to 66 or 22 and work to 67. At the end of, of working 45 years, only 5% of them are what we would call financially fit, and 95% of them are either continuing to work because they have to, not because they want to, uh, have unfortunately passed away or they're struggling financially. You know, who wants to, to as we say, retire and then not be able to do anything because you don't have the money uh, to do it. And, and the reason that happened is because people worked a plan for someone else's financial success. You know, I looked at this, I said, how do you get in that top 5%? That was my mindset. You know, my whole life, I, I'm a hard worker and I don't mind putting hard work into things I believe. But, but no matter how hard I worked, I didn't feel like I was really getting ahead the way I wanted to. I wondered, how do people live and have time to do things? Because you can only work so many hours. Well, one of the things I learned looking at this was 74% of the people who were in that top 5% were business owners. See, I wasn't going to inherit the money. I don't know about you. That wasn't happening for me. So the only way I was going to get there was to create it on my own. And if the best avenue of that, if three out of the four people got in the top 5% were in a business, then I was going to start a business and own it. And this allowed me to do that. We had what we call a two to three year business plan with the company. And that's to create a foundation to earn that extra income, that supplemental income that you're going to create. Um, what are the benefits of that? It could be debt reduction. What if you took extra money and you put it against your debt or you took extra money and you put it towards a, a savings for a college fund? I mean, we all know how expensive college has become these days, our university. Say, what if you put that money towards your retirement? What kind of difference would that make? Or maybe it helped pay a car payment or help pay part of your mortgage payment. And again, those tax advantages you're gaining right there are a money savings from being an entrepreneur. You know, the we're set up in the world for business owners. Those are the best tax brackets to be in, is to be a, a business owner. There's three things we do as a company. One, we have a product, what we call a product brokerage company. As a product brokerage company, we have hundreds of exclusive products and services. So what that means is we don't rely on the sale of any one product. We're not a one product or one area company. I would never be involved in one of those because what if times change? What if the product goes obsolete? And in today's day and age, doesn't that happen faster than it's ever happened? What we do is we have access to multi-billion dollar markets. We identify the latest market-driven products. We eliminate the burden of manufacturing and we bring those products out to the marketplace and it gives us flexibility. And I'll tell you the other thing it gives us, not only are we fluid and we can move fast, it means we don't have to keep anything that doesn't perform because we don't have all our money tied into the manufacturing. We're looking for top products to bring out and get to that end consumer. Second part of that is our internet marketing aspect of that. And I've mentioned before with thousands of partner stores, millions of products, uh, we have hundreds of exclusive products right on our shop.com site that our customers can order from. There's no cost to be a customer and our customers get cash back when they order there. And I'll, I'll dig into that a little more with those stores we're partnered with because they're big name stores you're familiar with. 
The third concept is a revolutionary concept called the shopping annuity that helps people convert their spending into earning through the unfranchised business and shop.com. You know, and to Lisa and I, to my wife, this is what we always think of. We're already spending it. Why not get paid for it? Uh, all of your purchases from, from your partner stores and Market America exclusive products are tracked. When you or anyone you lead to shops online, you then get 100% credit for those purchases. Uh, it's really an incredible tracking system that's been put, put together. And again, I'll share that with you as we go through part of that compensation plan. So when you take a look, you know, you see there's the 45 year plan. And I think all of us are probably gonna continue doing that because we need to keep that regular income coming in. But it's really trading time for money, isn't it? If we don't show up, we don't get paid. What I want to talk to you about tonight is a two to three year plan, which is investing eight to 15 hours weekly on top of what you're doing, creating that, that extra income and creating something that will continue for you. So if you'd like to see how it works, stay with me. Uh, if you're not interested, I thank you for taking some time to be on already. But now I'm going to walk through and share how the compensation actually works. One of my favorite slides is right here. It says earnings are depicted, uh, earnings depicted are typical and the success of any unfranchised owner will depend upon the amount of hard work, talent and dedication, which he or she devotes to building his or her Market America business. And people always say, Jim, why do you love this slide? Because I said, really what it's saying is if you don't do any work, you're probably not gonna make a lot of money. This is a real business. Yes, you can do it part-time, but you do have to put part-time hours into it. You do have to treat it that way. And if you treat it that way, you can be rewarded as you would with owning a, a real business. There's five steps to build an unfranchised business. I'm going to take you through each one of these steps separately, and then we'll put it all together so you see how the commissions work. Step one is apply. When you apply, there's two ways you can apply. You can apply as a sales representative, or you can apply as an unfranchised owner. As a sales representative, there's no subscription fee. Now, one of the, the major negatives as a sales representative is you don't get a shop.com personal site. So you don't have that shop.com site to lead your customers to, and you can't earn commissions with the company doing that. As an unfranchised owner, yes, you get to buy those products at unfranchised cost and make retail profit. You can participate in our training system. Uh, you have that shop.com personal site, plus you have six or seven other sites. Uh, depending on which areas you, you, you may be interested in. We have a Modus Cosmetic site. We have a TLS Slim site. Um, we have a MarketAmerica.com information site. We have a global site, which goes out to, people can order from over 180 different countries. You're also going to receive our unfranchised management reports. So you have the ability to track and run your business through unfranchised.com, and you can participate in our compensation plan and earn anywhere from $300 to, to $3,600 in weekly commissions per business. As an unfranchised owner, when you start, you'll get something called a getting started guide. Uh, which really takes you through what do I need to do right away to get this business up and running. You'll get a manual, rules and regulations to running your business and how to do it. Uh, a digital unfranchised owner magazine, which will come to you on a uh, monthly or every, month, uh, every other month basis. You'll get that training and seminar system I talked about. And I'm so proud of this training and seminar system because with that system, there's three trainings which are required as unfranchise owners as you're earning commissions. They're, they can all be done online right now. They're all very expensive. In fact, two of them are, I think, $5 each. But, but why do we require unfranchise owners to take training? Because we want to make sure if they go out and they talk to somebody, they know what they're saying and they do it the correct way. Um, and, and I love that my background came, came from a training background. Uh, I researched over 40 different companies before I went full time with this company. And, and when the training system was such an important part of that, because I thought if I want to build a big business, I can't do it all on my own. I need to have a system that other people can participate in and learn from other people. And that's what we have. We have an audio training series which people can have right on their phone, over 200 different trainings to listen to. We have an unfranchise.com uh, management reports I talked about earlier where you can maximize your business. And then probably the most important thing on this page is coaching and mentoring by experienced unfranchise owners. People who have already built the business, who are going to be on your team, who have a financial incentive in you succeeding. Now, people say, well, Jim, they have a financial incentive. Yes, they do. Just like if, if someone owns a, 
uh, is a franchisor and they have franchisees. They want their franchisees to be successful. Here's the difference. When I sat down to look at this, I said to the, the gentleman showing it to me, I said, Brad, can I make more money than you? He said, yes, you can. I said, great. That's the only question I needed to know right now. Because I wanted to make sure that if I was building a business, the fact that he started a couple of years before me, the fact that I was part of his team wasn't going to limit what I could earn. And it did. We've gone on to earn probably now over 10 times what he earned uh, in the business. But we worked harder at it and we stuck with it longer and did more with it. And, and you know what I call that? I call that fair. Uh, and that's the way a business should be set up. So step two is creating business volume. Business volume is a point total that's associated to all of our exclusive products to calculate commission. So I always think of it like frequent flyer miles. Uh, you know, you get a certain number of miles, you get a ticket. Here you get a certain number of points, you get a commission, commission check. I, I think of it as traditional business. It's how much volume is produced in a business, only here you're getting commissions for that volume that's produced. BV is typically about 70 to 80% of a dollar, depending on what category or what store we're dealing with. Meaning if $100 is spent, uh, you're gonna receive 70 to 80 business volume points, okay? So what are the categories? Health and nutrition. Let me ask you a common sense question. You think that'll grow over the next 10 years? I mean, uh, in the 20 some odd years I've been here, I've just seen that go up and up and up. And I think the next 10 years are going to be the, the largest growth on that. And we have a, a product called isotonic supplements. It's a powder-based vitamin that you add water to and you drink. It has no binders, fillers, and coatings. We have over 20 different products in that isotonic line. That's sort of the pillar of that. And we can continue to expand that isotonic line with all different products, including heart health items, items to help with sleep, items to help with stress, which is so important in this day and age. Um, but there's an area that's growth. That's where I focused on when I started, because as a customer, I had been buying three items in that area. I'd been buying a product called OPC3, which was a super antioxidant, still one of our best selling products in the company, a multivitamin uh, product uh, that we had, and a product called Thermochrome, which was for weight management, which leads me right into our weight management line, our TLS weight loss solutions. Now that's based on a low glycemic index. How many people, it's, it's January, what are we at, 14th right now, would like to take off some of those pounds and said, you know what, this year I'm going to do it. Well, why not get involved with our TLS weight loss solution? We have some great things going on right now. If you hashtag 20, 28 days uh, weight loss or talk to the person who brought you, you can find some things on Facebook we're doing. Um, but with that, it's based on low glycemic index. It's supplements, it's shakes, it's, it's, take, it's eating correctly, knowing what you're eating all put together. Then you look at age management. You know, people who take care of themselves want to age better. We're all going to age, but the key is aging and being able to remain active and do the things we want to do. So we have a line called Prime Anti-Aging Nutraceuticals. And people who take care of the health want, want to make sure their children and grandchildren are taken care of. And that's our uh, DNA Miracles line of high quality uh, supplements and products for our children and grandchildren. We have a personal care line with our fix products, which is a solution-based product, hair care product, our Royal Spa line of personal care, hair care, body care. We have a line called Layered, which is a jewelry line. You know, a lot of people, a lot of our customers were looking for a high quality line, but they wanted it to be inexpensive. So we came out and we sourced and found our Layered line of products to get that quality, get that look, but not have to spend so much money to be able to do that. We have a cosmetic line called Motives by Lauren Reidinger, and I'll tell you, uh, th this just continues to make waves in the motives uh, uh, in, in the cosmetic industry, and it, it's customizable, it's high quality. Um, talk to people about cosmetics. Go on Instagram, look at the following of Motives Cosmetics, and you'll see why this is such an important line with what we do. We have a skincare line, uh, multiple skincare lines with our Lumiere to V line, which we have for, for women, and we, we have our own line for men in the Lumiere to V line. Why? Because skincare is a huge area uh, and consumable that people use on a regular basis. I hope you've been knowing So I've been talking about these products. I want you to think to yourself, man, how many products do I use like this in my own home? And as you're thinking about that, think, so does everybody else you know. We have a web solutions product in our internet services division, which is 
uh, setting up websites for small to medium sized business. We work with a company that helps us with that. And, and then you uh, earn a commission and BV for doing that. We have cleaning products in our SNAP line. We have pet care products in our pet health line. We have an auto work, auto care products in our auto works line. We have a, an entertainment division with a marketing end called Conquer Entertainment. We have a financial services division where, where we have an incredible product called the Debt Treader, which is like a GPS that can help you get out of debt. It shows you exactly what to do with that. Now, I covered a lot of products and I'm gonna tell you my favorite one is right here, it's called Coming Soon. People always say, Jim, you are always so excited with where the company is going. Well, there's two reasons for that. One is for 24 years, I always knew whatever's hot in the marketplace, our company is gonna go out and find. So if something comes out, we're gonna have it next year. I'm not worried about missing it because as a brokerage company, we can do that. Second reason is because the last 10 years, I've had the good fortune of seeing how they do that as their vice president of sales and seeing the effort that goes into that and seeing what's coming out. I wish I could tell you what's gonna be out in the next three months, but I can't, but I can tell you, it's gonna make all of you very, very happy. Uh, when you see that. Now, I do want to tell the guests something. Don't get overwhelmed by all the product lines. Don't think I need to know everything. When I started, I mentioned before, I was a product user. I used three products. Guess what I focused on initially? I focused on those three products. I understood how they work. I liked how they work. I talked about them. Then I started learning more and more. And as my experience grew, I was able to add different things in. But what I love, I've got uh, makeup artists on my team. Now, I, I can't tell you or do your makeup, okay? But I have makeup artists, professional makeup artists that I can partner with. I have people who sell websites for a living on the team. Now, I don't know how to do it, but they're great at it. And we can partner together and share our common strengths together to be able to do that. So it means you don't have to be great at everything, but you do get to participate in everything. You also get to get everything at unfranchised owner costs. So you're saving a tremendous amount of money as an unfranchised owner. Our second step, again, is creating volume. But now I'm going to talk to you about IBV, which is internet business volume. Internet business volume is the point value assigned to any of our partner store products on or on Shop Local. So now you're looking at some of these stores. You're seeing things like Bed Bath & Beyond, Groupon, Walmart, Home Depot, Kohl's, Wayfair. Stores you may buy from all the time. And now you would get back in IBV points, 2%, 4%, 6%. It, it just depends on the store. Ristelli's is meat and fish delivered right to your home at 22% at IBV. I know the other day we needed paper towels, we needed garbage bags, we needed toilet paper. Went on walmart.com, boom, shipped to our door, 4% IBV. My wife needed contacts the other day. She went to AC Lens, 11% IBV. Here's the deal. I was buying contacts before we ever had internet business volume. We were buying toilet paper, paper towels, and garbage bags well before we ever had internet business volume. All that's changed is I now get paid for it. Does that make sense to everybody? And so, so think of three ways we're getting paid. One way is the retail profit we make when someone buys one of our exclusive products. I call that right now money because you make that right now. Second way commission we have is on BB products. Third commission we have is on IBV from our store. So three different ways we are able to generate additional income into our lives through this, this business. So how do you create BV and IBV? Well, you create it, to me, it's simple, like any business. One is in our business, you use your own products and you shop from your own site. If I owned a Target, I wouldn't shop at Walmart. And if I owned Walmart, I wouldn't shop at, at Target. I own Gym Mart. So I buy everything I can through my own business, whether it's my exclusive products or it's my online products. And I shop from all my, my own stores. Now that allows me to have a good education on, of saying when I talk to people that I've tried products as well. So when I talk to customers, I can then lead the customer sales and lead them to shop on our site to get cash back. So as an unfriend, owner, we're all looking to generate 10 to 15 regular customers. Many people will do many more than that, but a minimum of 10 to 15 customers. And we do a lot of that with one-to-one -one marketing, which is sharing how things work uh, on a one-to-one -one basis. We have the thousands of partner stores. We have a product, uh, a technology product called Shop Buddy, which you can download right on your computer. So when I went to, to say Walmart, I didn't have to go to shop.com first. I went to Walmart. It popped up. I clicked a button. It told me to click it. So I got the, the IBV points and then it gave me all the best deals 
on Walmart. So I got all the best by having that on my computer. And then we have our own brand of products called our shopping annuity products. I always say it's it's like if you owned Costco, you have Kirkland. Well, now we have shop.com and we have our shopping annuity products. We get higher value points on those IBV points or BV points for great high quality products. We have trial size marketing with individual products where you have the ability to, to market them on an individual basis so people can try them. Just gonna look and see if we actually have a new marketing app that allows your products to be sent where you can send something like this where you've got three different products in there and they have the ability, a customer would have the ability to try these. It comes in a beautiful brochure. We can send that out uh, for them. Uh, so trial size has been a very big thing for us. And then online orders and reorders. You know, uh, last night I uh, fell asleep. Uh, Lisa and I were watching a show. I, I, I woke up uh, as I got ready for bed. I looked at my phone. I had an order from a customer. Uh, I clicked something on my phone. It then said to, it told the company to send that order to the customer. I got the retail profit. I got the BV. I was sleeping on a couch when the order came. I didn't have to box things up and ship them. The company's taking care of that. This is why I want you to understand. To me, this was brilliant when I looked at this marketing concept because it took, it got rid of a lot of things I didn't want to deal with uh, and, and let the company do those where I got to build the business. Step three is to qualify your business. You qualify your business with an opening order of products. So every person's gonna have what we call a business development center. On your right-hand side of your screen, you're seeing what's called a business development center. Your name and a nine-digit ID number will go on there. When you qualify that with 200 business volumes, that now accumulates points, BB and IBB points. So you wanna accumulate that right away, either through selling through to customers or by ordering products right away to sell through to customers or use personally. One of the best ways you can qualify a business is what we call a fast start program. This is why I say you can get fully up and running with the business, fully qualified for well less than the cost of a cell phone. $429.95 plus tax, it's free shipping. It includes that $129.95 I talked about before. I wanna make sure you understand that. You get 300 BV, so you qualify with 200 BV and you have 100 BV that starts accumulating towards commissions. And you get an assortment of products from one of the areas you choose. So maybe you choose the, the general fast start kit and you get all of our uh, uh, best selling trial size products that will come with that. Or maybe your passion or your interest is in cosmetics. You had to choose the motives fast start kit. Either way, you have the ability to pick and choose with that and get your business up and running. Step four is to activate your business. You activate your business by identifying people you wanna partner with. Now, here's what I'm gonna tell you as a guest. What you wanna do is identify people that not that you think will do it, but identify people who will evaluate it. I looked at it and I said, okay, who would I like to evaluate this? Well, I'd like people that are coachable. People always ask me, what do you look for in people, Jim? I look for people who are coachable, well-connected. Uh, I, I look for people with desire for more, uh, people with good work ethics, because they'll know other people with good work ethics. You become a professional introducer. You work with your team to introduce this business, to have people evaluate it. They'll help you qualify the people, see if they're the right people. Because you don't want to waste your time with people who are going to waste your time. So you're going to look for the right kind of people to partner with you because you're going to have a teammate and teammates who are going to be coaching, helping, and mentoring. From there, we build two teams of people. In this case, let's assume Mark and Kate both qualified, became teammates. You brought them into the business. You're going to help Mark identify his 10 to 15 customers. You're going to help Kate identify her 10 to 15 customers. You're going to help them start to identify people that they know as well to build their business. And it won't build out perfectly like this. And something I always tell people, you know, when you identify people, some people you talk to may have no interest at all. Uh, they may be negative. They could be skeptical. People always say, Jim, why do you tell people that? Because that's what happened to me. I mean, here I had a very successful business career. Some people I talked to told me I was crazy. I said, I'm not crazy. You haven't seen what I've seen. Look at the business plan. Show me how it won't work if you put in 10 to 15 hours a week, how you can't make money. Because I honestly still don't believe if you put in 10 to 15 hours a week that you can't make money with this because it's just set up mathematically to work. With that being said, people lead to people. So what happens next? 
Mark might lead to Kate and or Mark and Kate may lead to Megan and Kevin and it goes on and all of a sudden it's not about who do you know it's about who do the people you know uh, know and I started figuring out if I had 10 hours a week to put into this business and Mark said Jim I'll commit 10 hours and Kate said I'll commit 10 hours and I started working with them well now my little business of just three of us I had 30 hours a week that were going into my business. And if I helped them and supported them and Megan said, I'll put in 10 and they led to Sarah and Rick, who I don't know. And they put in 10 and Kevin put in 10 and they let, and Kate led to Ann and Ben. See, now these are people I don't know, but all of a sudden my little business has seven people. And now I'm putting in 10 hours for the week, but I'm getting compensated on the work of 70 hours. How many of you'd like to go to work tomorrow, work 10 hours and get compensated on 70 hours? I think we all would, right? So now I started getting excited. I started understanding time leverage. And I said, okay, well, what if I identify another person, more than two, right? Because two just gets you started. I thought, okay, third person might go over here and I just build another team, right? That's what I did in my corporate job. Hiring a new manager certainly didn't help my existing managers. Here's where it changes. Forget about that. If you identify a third person, the third person is going to go down to the bottom of the organization. Everything they do is going to support and help the people that are already on the team. So if Matt comes in the business, starts with a fast start kit at 300 BV, that 300 BV is going to go to Chris, Megan, Mark, you, your senior partners at 100% credit on the volume, 100% credit of that 300 BV. And I started thinking, so now I'm really getting leveraged because as I identify more people, I'm supporting the people already on my team and that's giving them more hours while it gives me more hours, if you want to think of it that way. So what if I know a fourth person, maybe fourth person would go to the other side. And this all started clicking to me. And I think it, it finalized when I was home one night, uh, I was watching a, a Friday night, I was watching a TV show. One of my first people in the business called me up and said, hey, Jim, I'm, I'm really excited. I've been in, meeting with a couple people. They've qualified. I'm going to start one tonight and one tomorrow. And I said, that's fantastic. I hung up the phone. I started the movie again. And then I stopped the movie. I thought to myself, I'm sitting at home on a Friday night watching a movie. Yet my business is going to grow by two people because when they introduce two people, even though it helped them grow by two people, those two people are also my people. Now I put time, effort, and work into training that person. So now I'm getting something back for doing that. Does that I hope that makes good sense to everybody. What happens next is I realized also that the senior partners only have a left and a right side. What if my senior partner identifies somebody and brings somebody in my business? I get 100% credit on what that person does. Now I want you to think about that as you look at that. So what if you get your business started and what if tomorrow your senior partner brings somebody new and places them below you? You still have to identify your two to start earning commissions. Remember, we have to have two to start uh, that we personally introduce, but you're already getting credit on the volume coming up. Again, no brainer for me. I was like, how fast can I get going on this? What do I need to do to qualify? The next thing that I didn't fully understand in the beginning was take somebody like Drew here. If Drew gets a customer order, he makes the retail profit. That's fair. He sold it. But the 63 BV that's generated, Cheryl gets that, Sarah and Rick gets that, Mark gets that, and I get that. So even though he's moving the product, he's making the retail profit, I'm getting the same BV he is. Again, no levels, no percentages, down to infinity, 100% credit of that volume goes to each person that's connected to all the way back up to me. So as my business grows, I started to realize some of my best people were people that I didn't know that came in the business through other people, yet I still got 100% credit on that volume. Now here's how commissions are paid. Every day the company adds up that volume. On Friday night at midnight Eastern, it looks at your business. When you get to 1200 BV on your left, 1200 BV on your right, you receive a $300 commission from the company, a direct deposit. Now, here's where I, I didn't understand things. 1,200, what does that mean, 1,200 BV? Well, let's go back to one of my examples. We said we want to teach people to have 10 customers. One of our best-selling products is called our Daily Essentials Packages. And that's a one-month supply of four of our best supplements. It's 40 BV. So if I have 10 customers who do one month supply of 40 BV, that would be 400 BV they would produce as a uh, 
through customers. I would that Mark would produce through customers. I'm assuming Mark's going to use a bunch of products too, because why not replace what you have? But if he teaches that same thing to Megan and Sarah and Rick, and they each produce 400, well, now you can see how very easily easily we can produce 1,200 with three people with 10 customers each. See, the math went through my head. I didn't want to have to have 1,000 people. I wanted to have people who had customers who generated buy. I want to get paid like a real business. And I just teach the same thing to Kate. And suddenly that can turn into 300 a month with that. Well, what if that business gets bigger? Because, you know, the people there aren't coming in to make you money. They're coming in to make their own money. So what if they identify people? Now you get another 1,200 and 1,200. Remember, people are repeating. Products are running out month after month. They're reordering. Customers are reordering. So you get another $300, then another $300. Now, a key point I should mention is the volume is adding up week after week after week. It doesn't go away after a week. It doesn't go away after a month. It adds up 365 days on a rolling calendar or until you complete the pay cycle, which is going zero to 5,000 on each side of your business. You would then earn $1,500 in commissions and it would reset back again. Now, when it does that, I haven't even talked about something else that's occurring at the same time. What's happening at the same time is people, your, your business partners and their customers are ordering from partner stores. And it's the same thing. When you get to $1,200 and $1,200, you get a $300 commission. That sits there. When you get another $12 and $12, you get another $300. So you can see how this adds up. So now you've got two compensation plans you're being paid on and you're making retail profit. That's a weekly potential of $3,000 per business development center. What do you think will happen as it keeps getting bigger and bigger? It'll get faster and faster. You know, the first time you go through, it could, it could take months to earn your first $1,500 in commissions. But what if the next time it's three months? What if the next time it's two months? What if the next time it's one month? What if the next time it's two weeks? What if the next time it's one week? Because your business is continuing to grow and as more people do a little bit, it gets faster and faster. And, and that's really what I saw with the business as I continue to do it. One of my favorite things was the way the bonus structure worked. And every time you get to 5,000 and 5,000 BV, not for doing it in a week, but for when you do that, what happens is the company does a search down your left and the right side of your business and it whoops and it looks to see did someone on your left and someone on your right also get to 5000 and 5000 the same week you did if you did you get a $600 bonus from the company now I want to make that I know numbers get confusing so let, let's just put it in perspective basically what i'm saying is if your people are successful you make more money so where would you want to put your emphasis well you'd want to put it on your people with that being said, whoever's introducing you, if you guys partner together, they make more money if you and your teammates make money. So where are they going to put their emphasis on helping, training, and working with you so you become successful so they have the ability to make bonuses? I just think the plan works perfectly and brilliantly together. That means one business has the potential to earn up to $3,600 per week. I will tell you, you can have more than one business. I'm not going to show you that tonight because really you got to learn to build one first. It's like a franchise program. Once you build one, then you can start another. Uh, but like for Lisa and I, we have seven businesses that pay us on a regular basis. As a guest, you might be thinking, can this work for me? The person who invited you might be thinking, I hope they're the right kind of person for the business. You know, one guarantee I've always had in life is if you don't try anything, then everything's going to remain the same. Um, when I looked at this, one of the things I looked at, I said, is it good enough? Is my life good enough? Is it what I want or do I want more out of it? Um, this gave me that ability to do that. Here's what you can do to see if it can do that for you. Schedule a follow-up appointment and get your questions answered. I think that's a great thing to do. Um, try some products. Register as a customer and earn cash back. Totally makes sense to try products. Attend another unfranchised business presentation. Maybe invite some people to come with you and give it a trial run. Run it up the flagpole. See how it works by talking to some other people. I've got a couple things that you could do. One is right after this, really in about five minutes, I'm going to do something called a getting started right training. It's only going to be about 20 minutes. 
And I'm going to go into, if you would start with us, what are some things we would talk about having you do to get you started? Or if, if you're a new person, this would be great for you as well. And that's going to be uh, in, in about five minutes from now, you can talk to the person who invited you to get the link for that or go to Market America's Facebook page. I think you would see it there as well. Another thing I, I'd be remiss not to state is we have something called a World Conference coming up in uh, March. And it's going to be an online world conference. If you're like me, I wanted to know everything as fast as I could. Once I made my decision, I got tickets. I, I actually flew to Florida. I went to an event to learn as much as I could over three days. This is going to be a, an event that will be a three-day event. You can watch it from the comfort of your home. But it's going to be a tremendous amount of information, where we're going as a company, what products we're bringing out, and where we're going to take this over the next, next year. You guys have been great. I hope this has been helpful. Um, I look forward to meeting you in person someday. Uh, please come up to me, say, hey, Jim, I was on one of your presentations. I got started soon afterwards. Uh, I wish you nothing, nothing but success. Stay safe and stay healthy. And we will talk to you and see you soon. And I'll see some of you in about five minutes. Take care.